<clears throat> okay, we are back. Okay, gotta change some outfits first. <laughs> this outfit kills me. Uh, let's see, what do we have in terms of gloves? Actually, I don't like gloves. I find that gloves is a bit too distracting for my arms and stuff. Uh... This is a very cool hat. Potioner cap. I like the Hufflepuff one. I think it's nice. Ooh, this is fascinating. We're going back to this outfit.
always said that travel broadens the mind. See if there's something you need. Five thousand dollars, my God. Thank you for your patronage. That's been a pleasure. Yo, Evo, what's up, man? You're upgrading some shit right now. Okay, so what are we going to do today? Today, let's check out the quest. We have to do Venomous Tentacular, uh, acquire and use Mandrake on multiple enemies sim simultaneously. Okay, so I need a Mandrake and Venomous Tentacular. So I do not have a Mandrake. So Pleased buy to see Arnhat. See if there's something you need. Let me see if I can from this guy. They have a Mandrake right here. Thank you for your patronage. That's been a pleasure. Okay. All right. <clears throat> All right. Let me see. I feel like I want to venture around the uh, this area here because I feel like there's a lot of stuff that I haven't done. Yet. Oh, see, small bandit camp. Oh, by the way. Today's stream will be a bit short, I think, like you maybe one, only one and a half hours or something. Travel was before I invented flu powder. Pull yourself together. Can't be going about like this. Now divide, we must stop you. Simon's all finished. Akio, send me the My ears. I forgot to uh, uh, equip this one. Where is it? Confringo? Confringo! Let's play Predator and Prey, shall we? Thunder! Goodbye. It isn't all at Treadwell's precious Never have come here. Oh shit! Oh god damn! Oh my young friend. Oh my god, I almost died. What this guy can't move. Incendio. 
I have no idea why this guy was so difficult to take down though. He was Rebellion. like super hard boss to even pull. He's a heavy unit. Okay. So how do you pull a heavy unit? Interesting. You don't. Oh god. You can disarm. Oh right! I was using Confringo instead of Expelliarmus. No wonder I couldn't. Never mind. All right. I think we're done with this one. Yeah, I need to go to Herbology. All right. Since we're here anyway, I want to go in a little bit more deeper. I want to check out this area here. I want to see what's here. All right. Let's go. We'll do herbology after this, but I, like I said, you know, gotta always venture around, you know. Revelio. Yeah, there's like a spider place right here. I guess I'm not going that way. Who lived here, I wonder? Jesus Christ, there's like so much spiders here. Tip, is arm them right at uh, right time then they will damage themselves. Really? That's kind of cool. Revelio. That's a lot of spider webs, man. Revelio. Incendio. <laughs> they see me rolling. They hate it. <laughs> Follow the spiders, follow the spider, follow the spiders. Jesus Christ, man. Why? Who in the right mind wants to follow the spiders, man? Okay, hold on. What, what did you write? Uh, applies to a heavy unit, they will charge for a heavy attack like thunder. Oh. Okay. Revelio. Anything here? Oh, there's one up there. How do I get up there? You know when you eat popcorn and then you have that kernel stuck in between your teeth kind of thing? I'm having that feeling right now, you know? I ate something and then I feel like I have kernel stuck between my teeth. I hate it, man. <clears throat> I can't get it out of my teeth right now. We had corn. No, I didn't have corn. I actually ate chicken rice, which is surprising because I didn't think chicken rice would have this kind of thing. I think it's maybe the veggie or something. I'm not sure. Okay, there are some bad guys on that side, but I'm guessing those are spiders given the location right now. Good for you. Whoa, Rebellion. whoa, we have horses guys, but they're not horses, they're centaurs, but can I lift them? No, I can't. 
You know, if I could lift them, they would literally kill me. I'm just saying, you know. Just coming through. Just coming through. Why didn't they help me though? Anyway, every enemy can be counter or parried with certain spells or timing. Yeah, I, I know that. The thing is, I never really got time to study it yet. Spiders beware! Jesus, man. I'm telling you, this whole entire game... They're just very fascinated by spiders. Like, why These spiders? Seen better days. You know? Revelio. Must be something here, right? Look, there are normal people walking here. Are these dark witches though? Who are you? Talk. You're just normal people. Why are you doing the Forbidden Forest, man? Whoa! Guys! That's a freaking troll down there! Damn! Okay, that's not good. Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> Hit a troll with his own boulder. Defeat an enemy with a Chinese chomping cabbage. Uh, okay, better, better get out here because I'm gonna drop. Yeah, I, I don't know if I should fight him though. I feel like it's not a good idea. To... But how do you hit a troll with his own boulder though? How do you hit a troll with his own boulder? That's the question. Oh, I can go down there. Okay, let me go down that side. I can fight him. Uh, on level ground, I think it's easier. But how do, how do you parry his boulder? That's my question right now. Revelio. Is it like wing? Oh shit! That's a cotton grass dung bob. Not this again. Confringo. Levioso. Accio. Jesus Christ. Okay. At least I managed to lift oh shit. So many bad guys nearby. So did you kill the troll? Not yet, not yet. The troll is right there. The troll is still there. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out how we kill a troll. Come here. Come here, troll. We got this. Oh, I figured it out! I figured it out! Ha! Thunder! Oh, now my it didn't work. Incendio! 
Oh Jesus! I should, shouldn't stay so close. Shit! Nice! Yeah, why is there uh, inferiors there? Bro. Stench of death. Ugh, troll bogeys. What? Alright, troll bogeys it is. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. I like that. Although I'm not doing a lot of damage right now though. Wait, how do you... Do we break it down? Oh, I know. Uh, is this the Depulsor one? Yeah. Depulsor. There we go. Let's go. This looks intriguing. Why Why I want to collect his booger though? Troll bogeys. Or is it booger? It's some it's his booger basically. Ugh. Uh Rebellion. I guess we have a puzzle to solve, guys. Okay, the the chest is behind this thing. Alright, so let's see here. It's up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. So it's basically down. So uh Let me also. Oh shit, I think I might need a uh, Wingardium Leviosa for this. Shit. Oh crap. Yeah, it doesn't work. Ah, stupid thing. I can't lift you up and like and pick you. Okay, never oh, mind. Gotta go. You gotta learn that Wingardium Leviosa spell. You can pick your nose and your friends, but you can't pick your friend's nose, <laughs> dude. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> Just why? Revelio. What does it say? S beware spiders, Jesus man. Every everything also spiders. Incendio. Is the pulse a strong spell? I feel like it's not a damaging spell though. Right? But it is good for like knocking back people, so uh, maybe we we'll use Expelliarmus. I feel like Confringo doesn't do that much damage. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Rebellion. Anything here? What's that? What's Someone's, someone's under attack! The Pulsar does some damage, but it also can push others into each other. Oh! Okay, what the heck is that? There's nothing to poach in Aranger except spiders. Akio. Expelliarmus. Incendio. It isn't Nora Treadwood. The beasts around here can sleep a bit easier now. Revelio. Tip, when the frog is floating, use Psycho Cut on its... Ooh, okay. Defindo, alright. You know what that means? I kind of have to change my... What the hell was that? Why that yellow? Why is there a yellow indicator, man? I'm freaking out. Why is there a yellow indicator right here? Okay, now why it's gone. 
You know what that means? It means that I kind of have to do this, which I didn't want to in the first place, but I kind of have to. I gotta expand my spell knowledge. Hotkey. Alright, so, uh, with that said, with that said, let's change some spells, shall we? So, this one will be our main ones, right, obviously, but then, uh, how do you hold to assign? Ah, yes, okay, here we go. So, Confringo, uh, then this one here, then we have Depulso, and then... What's the another one that you can attack people with? No, I don't want to use Levio, so I already have that in my arsenal. Uh, you see, I don't have enough spells to make two full ones. No spell challenge. Now, I feel like I think having two sets is just enough. Uh, I don't need three sets. I think two sets is just nice. So yeah, I think just having two sets. The Pulso. What's the last one I can put? I guess I'm waiting for this one, Bombarda, right? Okay, I think we'll just wait it. I'm using all f Really? Do you really need all four though? I'm just lazy, okay. <laughs> what is this, Glacius? Oh, wow. Okay, well, it seems like I may have to... Yeah, okay, never mind. I think this is fine. So wait, how do you swap? Ah, okay. You can swap on the fly like that. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Alright, alright. Cool, 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 cool. Here we go. Here's another town. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. How can this little place even survive in the Forbidden Forest though? You know what I mean? Rebellion. What is this place? Spider Science. <sighs> Spider infestation has made this area particularly treacherous. Hmm. Not a big fan. And why is that? Why is that a dark bomb? Oh, wait. You know what? Let's try it out. Shall we? Ah! Shit. Oh, oh crap. Let me reset. What the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? Dude, that was... What was that? I was thinking that you're gonna just cut off his tongue like Octo Bogdo. You know? I wasn't expecting a one-hit KO. Oh my god. Then you get used to the controls. I forgot which spells I'm. Not my fault. You're a deadly girl. I forgot which uh, control I'm using at some point. I think you cut its tongue on neck. Defindo is definitely very very crazy. All right. Some chat probably. Expelliarmus. <laughs> Oops. Confringo. Okay, let, let's try to get in here. Revelio. Of course, there's a padlock here. My God, the one spell that we really mm. need. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Okay, let's see here. Okay, at least I can open this one. Rago Golden uh, Silk Rope. Okay. What's all this sound? Do you guys hear it? Like a, uh, it's like. I can hear the Dark Lord's mind or something. Ah, oh, I'm petting a cat, I didn't know. 
Use force push from a cliffside to launch enemy off. Force push? <laughs> Rampant dog bog. We have a monster now. Miss, if you see a bit driftwood, this thing. Uh, okay. Okay. I guess in the meantime, what I can do is this. Because it seems like I... Oops, sorry. My bad. Because it seems like I might utilize uh, this one. Levioso and then Defindo for this combination. Right, you know? Yeah. They sound... Is they something new? Okay, wait, let's see. Who's this? Hello. Do you have a moment? Yes, but just the one, I'm afraid. Uh, running the shop keeps me rather busy. Uh, I'm the new proprietor, Indira Wolf. Any whispers of anything going about the town? There's a rampant dug bog on the loose. It's more aggressive than others and has some peculiar markings. It's making life miserable in Pit Upon Ford. I wish someone would do something about it. Can you tell me more about yourself? I haven't had a normal conversation with anyone for a while, so pardon me if I'm a little rusty. My father passed away recently and I've been completely occupied with keeping the business afloat. I hadn't realised how much work went into running a shop. Inventories, maintenance, customers, bills, accounts, and on and on. <laughs> what can you tell me about your shop? It may not be as fine as what you'd find in Hogsmeade, but I think we have a certain rustic charm all of our own. We sell all sorts of beast byproducts for potion making. Some of the rarer stuff too. That all falls on me now. I just realised something. So, you realise that my camera now is at the bottom. Is that interfering with anything? Or do you guys prefer it at the top? Oh, what preference, you, you know. Do you know what you might be looking for? I have no idea what I'm looking for. Do you recall feather? Wow. There's a lot of ingredients which is stuff I've never seen before. Okay, never mind. This sells Why is my stuff still cost exactly sixty bucks? What I needed. Thank you. You can't really earn a lot of money by selling these, you know. I killed a frog one by accident before I got here and they said thank you. It only blocks your spells, other than that it's okay. That's what I was thinking, you Thank know. Thank you for your business. Hope you'll come and see me again. You guys can't really see my spells. Like, you don't know what spells I'm using. I wonder that bothers you guys, though. I think I'm going to shift it back up again. Yeah. I'm going to shift it back up again. Just because, you know, it's better to see what spells I have in line. All right. Wait, no. Oops. All right. Much better. Okay, perfect. Revelio. Can I go inside here? Yes, I can. Give me your free money, guys. Free money, money. Uh, dude. It seems like you're kind of sitting the wrong way. You know? Like, I suggest try lying down properly or sitting properly. Not through <sighs> this chair. It seems a bit uncomfortable, don't you think? <laughs> but, you know, you do you, bro. You do you, you know. Rebellion. There's a lot of people here though. Surprise. Whimsical sorcerer hat. That's cool. Revelio. Yeah, let me see if I can go up there. Uh, how do I get up there? Oh, this way. Wait, is it? Ah, uh, no. Let me check. 
Oh, I gotta go through this way. Okay. You know what? I just realized something. I can freaking fly in a freaking broom. Why am I trying to f Oh god. Sometimes I don't what even know what am I said. thinking, you know? I can literally I know fly, I'm man. When I, see one. I can literally fly. Alright. What is that? Okay, what trial is this? Oh, oh, do we just jump? Not so tricky after all, Merlin. Oh, okay. That is weird and simple. I like simple trials. Parkour. <laughs> Rebellion. Anything here? Nope. Why is that balloons up there? Yeah, never mind. Don't mind the balloons. Oh, I could have climbed up here, I think. Okay, let's see. Uh, I want to go to the flu powder thingy stuff. Okay, slow down. Slow down, bro. Slow down. Okay, how, how do you slow down on your broom? Uh, what's the control again? I... Wait. How do you slow down? How do you slow down? There we go. I think I'm gonna follow the b butterflies. Oh, crap. There's gonna be some bad guys going on there. hell is down there? Shit! So many spiders. Guys, watch out for the spider. Could you fly to the balloons? I stick. Wait, hold on. Let me follow the butterflies first. So many people in the freaking forest man didn't expect this many people in the forest Ooh, hello large rugs ah okay we all like rugs use revolt while on a broom it will help <gasps> oh my god this is like so much helpful What are you up to now? Please swing flies. Get uh, upgrade and it will have a larger range. You know, I think I have one more upgrade. Might be very helpful though. Yeah, I have one more. Ah, uh, yes. Alright, perfect. Perfect, perfect. What level should I ask that you're at right now, Evil? I'm a bit afraid to ask as well. Yeah, I don't know if I should. <laughs> Oh shit, wrong spell. You'll pay for that. Confringo. Confringo. Reducto. Confringo. Confringo. One less poacher in the wizarding world. Revelio. Only if you really want to know. <laughs> At this point, I'm not surprised already. I think you're quite far, if anything. Like, super, Rebellion. super far. So yes, hit me. 
Let's see how far you are right now. Or maybe you already finished the game. <laughs> Actually, not surprised you finished the game already. Ah, wouldn't mind a bloody job at Gringotts. Suit me sitting around all day. Mind you, I suppose it could get a bit boring. Uh, let me do that one first. It's a bandit camp there. Level 32, damn Rebellion. man. Okay, let's see here. Accio! Expelos! Incendio! Let me also not wipe. Don't mind me. Thunder time. Oh no. Accio! Expelio! I will thank you. Let me also incendio. All right. Revelio. I'm not even near done. Just been battling, exploring. Cool. Exactly as everyone should, you know. Collection update. Ooh, this is nice. I want you to take as much time as you need to finish this game because I feel like I'm going to take a long time to finish this game. Rebellion. Anything here? No. Alright, let's do that one. Could it be a Merlin trial? Merlin trial? Okay, please tell me I have a spell for this. Expelliant. Oops, no. Confringo. Confringo is such a strong spell. Merlin himself would be proud. Oh, nice. I've been seeing people rush the story or explore around heavily. Honestly, I don't understand rushing this game. It's such an awesome game. Like, just take your time, you know? Sometimes pet a cat, grab a coffee, and then, you know, just enjoy the scenery and stuff. It's good stuff. Okay, let's see here. I want to go here because I need to get one more of that. I try not to use the broom as much as possible unless I have to like fast travel because I really want to like get everything on the ground you know if possible. Or something I'm going something tell me that I'm gonna get hit I'm gonna get attacked by spiders like the one up there. Crazy. What the hell is this place? What the hell is this place? Uh, okay. Such a creepy place. Wait, what does it say? Oh gee, extreme danger? Playing Unite as support is so fun. Are you sure? It seems like you're always angry about it. Oh Jesus. Please tell me there's no more bad guys.
The creepy sound is coming from the Merlin trial. Revelio. You guys realize that? The creepy sound is coming from Merlin trial. Merlin, why do you have to make it so creepy though? Okay, now what? Now what? Oh my god, don't tell me I have to do Wingardium Leviosa crap. I'm guessing I'm not ready for this one? Oh wait, 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 what if I... Cut it. Nope, can't hit it. Do a flip. I don't have flipendo yet. Hey, that sound disappeared. I guess he got tired. <laughs> he got tired, the sound. Oh no. Okay, I, I guess I'll come back to this later on. Okay, I gotta go back to this thing. Right, let's go. Adventure, guys. Adventure. Okay, after this, after this one, we'll do the Herbology one. Alright. Because I need to get Wingardium Leviosa anyway. Spiders. Hate them. Hate them so much. Alright, cool. Wait, garlic is the abology, right? Yes, that is correct. It says that Hogwarts is this way, Forbidden Forest is this way, and Hit something is this way. Okay. I thought we we're in the uh, Forbidden Forest. Why, why does it tell me that I have to go this way? If anything, I already explored this area, so that's kind of cool. Alright, back to Hogwarts, guys. We'll do one thing at a time, you know, eventually. Mm -hmm. This one. You were outside the forest. Oh, really? I wasn't in the forest? <laughs> I didn't even know that. Northern side. Doesn't that still count as the north side of the Forbidden Forest? I mean, like, it's still Forbidden Forest, Want just north side. <laughs> okay, teach me. You can advance time by pressing R3. Oh, I gotta wait? Hey, I just realized that I haven't collected my Dittany. <laughs> Takes 10 minutes. Way too long, bro. Way too long. Hello, lady. Professor, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never cared. I mean, really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a Wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvellous creatures that resemble a twig. Oh, bow truckle. Beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely. Ooh. Terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's <laughs> for him. Oh my god, that's comical! I I mean, okay, if you're talking about my reaction, it has to be that's comical. 
<laughs> Fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacular and... Well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. I'm glad everything worked out as it did and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. Guess how old she is though. Based on observation, I want to say that this professor here is... She looks like she's like, what, 20? Five at most? I don't know. Observe. <laughs> Bro. Where'd she go? Oh, she's still there. Okay. Looks at her backside. Hey, she. <laughs> In my defense. Never mind, let's watch. She makes things grow. How wonderful to see you again. I want to change my hat. <laughs> I say, <laughs> I want to change my hat. I feel like my hat is looking a little bit ridiculous already at this point. Um, yeah, let's make it even more ridiculous, shall we? Oh wait, we gotta impress the professor. Professor, what do you think of me right now? Am I a, your chat? You know, I look like a. What, what do you call that holiday? The uh, the green holiday. What do you call it? Green holiday. Come on. Hit me. St. Patrick's Day. Thank you. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. Swish and flick. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Alright. You look like a Lucky Charm mascot. <laughs> I sure hope so. Okay, let's pick up Boulder, shall we? Wingardium, the Levitation Charm uh, can levitate and move objects, control its position, movement, and this thing to fine tune its distance and rotation. Okay. Well done. Feel free. Let's see here. Where is it? Is it this one? Ah, yes. Guardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse. I've set some crates on Guardian Leviosa. Pure and natural. Wait, how, how do you. Okay, how do you rotate it? How do you rotate it? Okay, this is to this one. How do you rotate it? Okay, I just destroyed the box. Deep had to rotate. No, 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 no. I, I already tried that. Okay, so... Obviously... Come towards me. Okay, how do you float it up? How do you float it up, though? Right stick. Oh my god, okay. 
Right stick is to move up and down. Then rotate it is like this. Okay. You like that, Professor? Maxima potion. Cool. I'm gonna destroy more of your boxes. Because there's stuff in it. That's cool. I didn't know there's stuff in it. Rebellion. Oh, Akio, it'll automate become Winger. Whole oh, Akio? Wait a minute. Are you are you serious? Uh Oh! Bro! 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 So you're telling me that by lifting something and then I use Accio. Jesus! I learned something new. Thank you so much for this. This was very helpful. Very, very helpful. I like that. Very handy. Thank you. My god. This means I don't actually need to use the Wingardium Leviosa spell as one of my key slots, you know? Which is good because I'm trying to reduce as much as possible. Okay. Uh, more quests or should we continue the main quest? I guess we can talk about the main quest, but... Uh, I feel I want to do some side quests too. I feel I want to do some side quests. Mainly, I want to go venture around this area, but... You know what? I feel like I need to... Before I venture out more, I should do more main quests first. Just because I want to get that freaking... You know... Key... I need to unlock keys, you know? Uh. Okay, hopefully this one sorry. And you also went on to do the exact same Rebellion. Hey, there's something up there. How do you get up there? Bro, how do you get up there? If it isn't the treasure hunter. Still can't believe you found that old how do you get a oh there's a lock over there. Alright, never mind. <laughs> Galleons and a historian's uniform. Do we really need to practice flying on a broom? Oh, I'm fun as fly! Am I going the right way? Apparently not. I'm not going the right way. Locked is in the charms. Oh, all right. The best way to learn how to fly. It's downstairs. Hello, I Professor. I was hoping to see you. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Hmm. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. Eldridge Diggory's portrait in the common room told me about his great niece, Helen. His great niece? Yes, she used to be an aura. Well, she took me to Azkaban to meet Anne Thisby. You went to Azkaban? Quite an experience. But, you see, Anne knew Richard Jackdaw before he died, so I had to find his ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. 
And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. All right. From the last episode, we, ha we forgot to bring the book. Okay. What the heck? Did I just teleport here? Jesus. The room is called the map chamber, by the way. And the portrait of Percival. All right. Since I'm no longer with um, the lovely garlic, we're going to change our outfit again. <laughs> uh, we're going to look like a police, shall we? <laughs> because, you know, got to always dress for the occasion. Uh, where's my police outfit? Actually, the outfit is not bad. Ooh, this looks like a police outfit. Ah! I look exactly like the police right now. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them. And Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. 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 Always the troublemaker. Perfect travelers, the both of you. Keep your wits about you. How about... Oops. I gotta change this. How about... Good for you. Ha ha. <laughs> Let's do this. To think it was beneath us all this time. I gotta say, this place is huge, man. Like, ridiculously big. Look, the police is here. <laughs> this looks promising. He looks like a kid when he found uh, cotton candy, you know. It's dandruff. <laughs> if only you were here to see this. Damn, Professor Rackham. Hello, Professor Rackham. Rackham, I placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting Gringotts? Uh, what was it again? The one in Gringotts. I can't remember, remember anymore. Okay, I don't recall it fully. I do recall seeing the memory, but I don't remember all of the details. My friend Charles and I spoke of the port key 
and of trials we'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Oh, trials. Charles right. is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Okay. Shall we have a look? It was a warm up. Yes, I know, right? Fighting the spiders. God damn spiders. I that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. What tower is that? I don't think I have. Perhaps your young friend is not as well traveled as you think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. You said that you know that tower. What can you tell me about it? Not much, I'm afraid. I've passed it dozens of times. It's north of Hogsmeade. My recollection is that it seems abandoned. Clearly, however, the tower conceals more than meets the eye. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. Okay. How would you like to learn the knockback jinx flippendo? Ooh. Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Flippendo? I do like flippendos. First trial, eat five Popeye's biscuit without drinking sweet tea. It's time you learned, Iglesias, the freezing spell. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Okay, so two spells. Is that all? Remember Flipendo. I can't, I know Rip, I know Flipendo. Uh, okay, let's see here. Grow and harvest Fluxweed. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. Oh, come on, are you serious? Okay, pop balloons over Hogsmeade Station. Pop balloons around Quidditch Pitch. I think Glacius is easier to do. Alright, uh, we going to Hogsmeade first. We going to Hogsmeade, guys. Spam mail, congrats, you just won a free cruise ship. <laughs> yeah, in Harry Potter, Flipendo was the main skill, that's why. I can't fly? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bro. Why can't I fly? Wait a minute, why can't I fly? I'm not allowed to fly here? 
maybe I'm allowed to fly outside. No? Still not yet? I can't fly? No fly zone? Oh, I have to leave this place! God damn it. Oh, there's a few Merlin trials here. Okay, you know what that means. We gotta get more Merlin uh, thingy stuff. No fly zone in Hogsmeade. Yeah, it seems like it. Okay, let me get more Merlin indeed, your field things, guide. You know. I'm most pleased to be included. Gotta get more Merlin seeds. Merlin seeds. They say that you can flip a cow. We're gonna try it after we get Flipendo, okay? See if there's something you need. Uh, no, you don't have any more stuff. Boo! No stuff. Damn it. That's been a pleasure. All right, never mind. How do you like a uh, speed on speed dial? <laughs> Ah yes, here it is. Pop the balloons, shall we? Hooray! Hooray! Where's one more? Wait, where's one more? Landing not available right now. That's weird. No, I swear I won't be wasting your time. Revelio. Ah, okay. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. There's one more balloon. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I see it now. Technically, if you hit the balloon like that in real life, you'll be pushed back and fall. Uh, yeah, that is true. You cannot just pop it like that. I don't think it works that way. Okay, I gotta go to the Quidditch pitch. Can I teleport there instead of like... You know. Is that the train station? The yes, it is. Was before I invented flu powder. Ah. I'm still learning how to fly this broom. Not easy, I gotta say. Where's the last one? Where's the last one? It's around here somewhere. Where's the last balloon? Oh, you can't... Oh, it's right there. I didn't know you could do that. Thank you, Evil. What would I have done without you, you know? Okay. Let's go learn a skill. Okay, how, where do I go? Hogwarts map. Is it here? Yes, correct. She is currently...
Okay. Oh, by the way, uh, I won't be able to stream too long tonight. That means I'm going to end my stream a bit earlier than usual today. But good news is that I will stream tomorrow because it's my day off. So yeah, a bit short today, but I can stream tomorrow. Hooray! What, what the hell? Oh, it's up there. Rebellion. Dear Madam Kogawa, the broom closet. I'm writing to you with Professor Black decision cancel Quidditch. <gasps> oh no. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. But... Pay attention to your wand. My, my question is this. Why is my flying uh, professor teaching me a spell? You know, like, I'm trying to understand why she is the one to teach me spells. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. Ah, okay. Uh, let's see here, which one is this one? There you go! Catching on quickly! Wow! Ice Beam! <laughs> it is Ice Beam, man! It's literally Ice Beam, holy shit! Rebellion. It's literally Ice Beam, man. If anyone tell you differently, you're wrong. Okay, so let's see. The next quest is the Flipendo one. So I want to see how difficult it is. Grow and harvest Fluxweed. Alright, so first things first, let's go to uh, the Herbology lab. Or I can actually do it in the secret room. I can do it in the secret room. I don't need to go to the herbology lab, right? So, plant planter. There we go. So, what is it? I need to plant again. Fluxweed. All right. Purchase from Magic Neep. <sighs> okay. I guess we're going to Hogsmeat then. Uh, where is the Magic Neep shop? Is it here? Ah, here it is. Hogs meat. <laughs> she taught you ice because it gets cold while flying in higher altitude. Shouldn't she teach me like fire or something to keep myself warm? You know, instead of adding more coal. Those that last clip. Hello, be with you in a bit. Hello, hello there, mate. Now you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Okay, what is it I need? I need uh fluxweed. Okay. Flux wheat stem. I don't even know if I have it. No my. We'll go don't back first. Say I don't keep a stack shelf. We'll go back first because. Eighteenth century attitude. Suck it up, Buttercup. Fire is dangerous in the on the broom. Really. All right. Let's see here. Wait, where's my flux wheat? Incorrect pot size. Excuse me? Incorrect pot size must be grown in large pots. 
<laughs> Are you serious? Okay, uh, where is it? Conjuring spell. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright, where's my pot? Where's my large one? Small pot, small pot, small pot. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. That's not how you make it. You need to do altercation, right? Okay, I gotta do altercation. Where is it? It's this one, right? Yeah. I gotta really remember some of these things, you know? Alright, so... How do you make this bigger? This is small pots. All oh, these are for small pots. Rotate. No. Wait, no one tell me. I will figure this out myself. Okay, how do you make this bigger? How do you make this bigger? Hmm. Oh, wait. Oh, here it is. Wait. Oh my god. Okay, let's see here. I got a conjure. Wait, 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 wait. This is not right. Okay, so what's my budget here? What do I need to do? Purchase from tombs and scrolls. I gotta buy from tombs and scrolls. How do you buy from tombs and scrolls? Okay. You know what this means? I gotta go back to Hogsmeade again. So tombs and scrolls. It's one of these ones here. Free broomstick, zonko, hog's head, tombs and scrolls. All right. Are you streaming in the afternoon? I think I'll probably stream in the afternoon. Probably. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. But I'll let you guys know because, yeah, I got things to do too. You know. All right. Let's see here. Hello. Hello there. Come on in. I actually Friends never buy anything from you. Here. Finally, something to buy. Okay, let's see. Here we have a uh, potting table with medium spellcraft. Potting table with five small pots. How many stuff do you have? Potting table with medium pots. Potting table with medium pots. Ah, here we go. Potting table with large pot spellcraft. Damn, this one is like potting with two large pot spellcraft. Jesus, man. Okay, we'll just buy one, okay? Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? All right. Time to head back to Hogwarts. All right, where was I? We need to grow that weed, I know. <laughs> flux weed. Damn you, flux weed. Alright. We have unlocked certain things. There we go. Alright, this is blue. Now we gotta we gotta go with the theme, alright? We gotta go all yellow, okay? Alright, here we go. I think this should be fine. All right, Dittany flux weed. There we go. Fifteen minutes. All right. While this thing is going on for fifteen minutes, let's do something first. All right. It says that I need to. What's it? I need to acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. So this one is mandrake. Okay. So I have to use all three. So I just need to buy a mandrake, which I do not have. So Mandrick, we can buy from Hogsmeade again, from this dude, right? I think so. 
I think the I think that guy has. Yo, Six South is in the chat. If you say some, if you say your potty nice table thingy you, fast enough, friend. it become a tongue twister. Really. All right, let's see. So Do you have a mandrake? Oh, you. What a pleasant surprise. You don't have mandrake? Get out of here. Oh man, all oh, fertilizers, okay. Uh This dude doesn't have mandrakes, no man. Say I don't keep a stack shelf. You don't have mandrakes, okay? You have you have to be ashamed of yourself. I always come to this guy right here. I feel like he has mandrakes. If you say your potting table thingy fast enough, it becomes a tongue twister, but you can't say it once. What? Or oh, steal from greenhouse? Can you steal mandrakes from greenhouse? Evo, confirm for me. Can you actually sell uh, sell sell mandrakes? No, no, no. steal mandrakes from uh, the from the greenhouse. That's interesting. Don't steal from Professor Bay. <laughs> ah, yes, mandrakes. Okay, five hundred bucks. Thank you for your patronage. That's been a pleasure. I didn't see any. Okay. Alright, let's go battle. Alright. So, we will go somewhere where there's going to be some battling to do. Uh, spiders. Not fan of spiders. Uh, is there any, like, place that has bad guys that I haven't fought yet? Probably some place, right? It doesn't matter. I think around here should we already have bad guys. Just by walking around here. You know what? Let's just fly, alright? I think I fly and find something faster in this. Okay, where are you bad guys? Ah, there's one right there. Hello. Okay, this one. I feel like there's a lag. Oh shit, I just wasted. How do you acquire and... Oh man, I missed one! It killed everything so fast! Jesus, man. You have to use all three at the same time. How do you use all three at the same time? I feel like... like I feel like equipping each of them one at a time is so slow though. You know what I mean? Like potions. Okay, okay. I guess I gotta do it quick. I gotta do it really, really quick. Where's the dude again? Hello. I believe you are ready to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in midair. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Okay, we have Arresto Momento. Cool. See if there's something you need. Okay, I need another one. Okay, please. Thank you for your patronage. Okay, we gotta That's find. Been a gotta find one more, more than one bad guy. Let's go into the forest, shall we? I think like whenever we go into the forest, right? Uh, there will be definitely a lot of bad guys. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Okay. That is inferior, so I don't think I that. I think I'll see around here. I think that's an inferior, so inferiors are uh, immune. Okay, there's a poaching ranger. There's only one dude there. Wait, is that inferior or is that like a poaching person? If it's a poaching person, then I can fight him. Oh, it's it a poaching tracker. Beast, okay. Or it can feed you. All right. I prefer the latter. Abandoned. You're the little sod that saved Treadwell. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, 
Plant cabbage, then mandrake. Ah, all right, that makes more sense. <laughs> that makes more sense. <laughs> okay, perfect. We have settled one. I think the next one is fifteen more minutes, right? Is that a way to check the timer for my this thing? Uh, for my flux weed, flux weed. All right, gotta go back to the flux weed. What the hell is this? Oh, the tower's there. Okay, I didn't know. Timer stop while on the. B Are you serious? <laughs> oh my god, that sucks. Alright. So when you're on the book, the timer stops. So you kind of have to like hang out here. How long more? 10 minutes! <laughs> no! Why is it so slow? Okay, while it's so slow, let's do some. Transfiguration, shall we? Um, all right. I'm going to change the floor. I think this one looks nice. Yeah. Okay, cool. <gasps> it's sprouting. It's sprouting. Okay, okay. What's this one? Ooh, scientific wall pediment. Okay, that flash is not comfortable. Ooh, this one looks very Ravenclaw-ish though. I think I like this one. Okay. Scientific wall. Hey MT, welcome to my crib. <laughs> oh, this one is nice. Wait, that wall doesn't change this wall? No! Oh my god, is it really that terrible? Okay. I gotta change all the walls? I feel like I'm playing Sims. <gasps> you can change the upper le upper corner as well. Oh my god. Oh wait, you can hold X. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. I just realized something. I just realized something, alright? No one get mad. No one get mad. You can press hold X and it applies for everything. I wanted a strip club, but Professor Weezy said it's not a school appropriate. <laughs> okay, since it's doing something, let me just brew something too. Can I interact with this guy? I don't want it so dark. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I like the more warm and cozy one. Wait, no, I wonder. Natural and earthy. Yeah. I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy as though I'm outdoors. Oh, sounds perfect. Okay, let's check it out. Oh my god, isn't that a bit too bright? I feel like this is a bit too bright though. It's too bright. Too much sun, man. No, 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 no. Change it, change it, change it. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I want uh, a warm, cozy one. Oh, we haven't tried the dark and mysterious yet. Let's try warm and cozy. I'd like the room to be warm and comfortable, as if I'm floating inside a mug of butterbeer. What? Mug oh, of butterbeer? Perfect. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Okay, this is much better. You know? Definitely much better. 
But let's change one more, okay? I want to see what the night Should one I talk looks to you like. about changing the room's ambience? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I want to do dark and mysterious. I'd like the room to feel mysterious and eerie. As if I'm in the forbidden forest, surrounded by shadows. What? Hmm, oh, sounds perfect. <laughs> it's a very, very terrible description. Sounds like you saw such a creepy... Pl what the hell is... No, I don't like this one. I don't like this feel. This one is very bad. It feels like a haunted place. Jesus Christ, man. What do you guys like the most? Like, okay, if you get to pick, which one do you like more? Do you like the this one? Do you like the bright and shiny morning one? Do you like the... You like this one? Okay, you are the weirdo here. <laughs> Let's do some potions, shall we? Brew some uh, steam packs, you know? That one. What is that one? I like moonlit one. Moonlit one is nice, I guess. There's some stuff that I can brew. Invisibility on. Uh, maxima potion? I don't know man, this one is just too creepy for me right now. How, many, how long? Five more minutes ago. Okay, perfect. Alright, like five more minutes. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Personally, I don't like the... Uh, natural and earthy one. Cool moonlit ambience is the one that I had originally when I entered, you know. But the warm and cozy, I feel like the best for me, cause I like it a bit brighter. Oh, forgot. Let Let me compare with the moonlit one again. I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Hmm, oh, sounds perfect. Okay, this one is very eerie and creepy. Huh? I guess this one is not bad. Now I think about it. After you compare it to everything else, this one is actually not bad. You know? It's not so glaring to the eyes, you know? You are the weird one. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, this one is done. Oh, cool. So many potions to make. Can I sit down? I can't even sit down in my own chair. Okay, let's plant some Dittany. How much space do I have? Ooh, let's change this thing. Oops, no. Oh my god, what is that? So, we have a lady, and then we have some dude with horns. We have a freaking owl. The owl is creepy though with the eyeballs, don't you think? And then we have a- oh my god, that is even more creepy. It's a lady without a face. Gothic wall, a cove. I don't know, man. The bird looks okay, but it looks a bit too plain. Something tells me I like this one a lot. You know? Hello. Alright. Let's go with this one as well. I can't see shit. <laughs> Hello, I can't see. <laughs> what? No, 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 no. How, how do you change this one? Okay. P aim? Alright, there we go. Ah, this is very greenery-ish. Okay, let's go with the green one. Perfect. The lady look like Inazuma statue in Genshin. Really? Two more minutes. Yeah. Oh my god, we haven't changed this one yet. Wait, have we? We changed this yet? Oh wait, we already changed this one. All right, perfect. What else have we not changed? Uh, I 
like this one. It's about the same. Alright. We haven't changed this one yet. Ooh, this one is nice. Hey, marble. I like marble. Definitely not this one. I like marble one. Nice. Perfect. Alright. One more minute to go, guys. Okay, let's see if I can change anything here. Nah, this one's already changed. Do you guys like this big ass picture here? What else is there? Let's make this one super big, alright? Yeah! Perfect. <laughs> alright, 24 seconds, let's go! I like your crypt so far, thank you! The only thing I'm not satisfied yet is all these tables. Obviously, I have to like rearrange them nicely. And obviously, this floor mats have to go. This floor mats looks really weird. <laughs> but apart from that, I really like this one. Look at this. It's so... Decor, you know? I don't know why I use that word, but yes. Hey, hear that? It's done! Great. Wait, what? Oh, perfect. Okay, alright. Cool, cool, cool. We can go back to garlic. Time to go back to Professor Garlic. You can change the color of the tables too. Yeah, I noticed too. I think Open we'll change it another time, you know? Professor Garlic, I'm here! That's a hybrid. Bounce Did you miss me? I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful! I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flipendo? Chin up. Keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. Okay, quiz time. Uh, at least it's you not really a quiz. Why? Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few pots. Why is she teaching me flipendo? Flipendo is a charm skill being taught by a charms professor. So why is she the one teaching me this, right? Doesn't make sense at all. Make it make sense. Professor Bay. <laughs> All right. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just mind. The so, Flipendo is a force. Oh, wow. So, you can actually flip objects and enemy upwards and backwards with a short cooldown, excellent at setting up extending juggles. Ability to flip object instantly, useful for solving puzzles and exploit enemies' and weaknesses. Alright. Before I forget everything. Nice. So it floats in the air. It's a little bit like Leviosa, except that it's Flipendo with Leviosa, you know? Flip table. <laughs> she used Flipendo to push her colleagues so that she can put her plants. I wonder what happens if you aim at her and then you fire. Nothing happens. <laughs> really cool really really cool all right so with that said we have done uh pretty much a lot of stuff the next one is arresto momento before we do more side quests and venturing but i will stream again tomorrow okay i gotta go already like i said today's stream is a bit short i'll catch you guys next time take care